Well, good afternoon, Garmin GTN owners and users. This is Gary, guy in the pink shirt, and I want to show you a quick mastery trip uh, tip. Sorry, about finding the nearest Tracon or approach departure frequency. The Garmin GTN and the GTN 750XI are the best things Garmin's produce. They're really amazing, and they give you a lot of information on the nearest page, but they're missing something that's there. I just got to show you the shortcut to find it. So obviously it shows you the nearest airports, the nearest intersections, the nearest VORs, the nearest NDBs, the nearest user waypoints that you've created, the nearest airspaces, and the nearest center frequencies, along with the nearest flight service frequencies, and even the nearest weather frequencies. But where's the nearest Tracon or approach departure frequency? Well, there's a quick way to do it. The nearest Tracon frequency is found using the nearest airport button. So what we're gonna do is from the map page, I'm just gonna very quickly push the home button then I'm going to touch the nearest. I want to touch nearest airport. And then I want to touch the nearest airport with a four letter identifier. In this case, Decatur, Texas, Kilo Lima Uniform Delta. Many of the private airports that only have three characters don't have instrument approaches. Therefore, they will not show the nearest approach and departure frequency. So instead of trying and then going back and trying and going back, it's much quicker just to look for the nearest four letter identifier airport because almost all of them have approaches. Then I'm going to touch the frequencies tab. I'm going to scroll down to find the first departure frequency. I'll touch that first departure frequency. In this case, it's going to be 118.10. And then I'm just going to load 118.10 to COM active. Let me show you how quick this is. Home, nearest, airport. I'm going to look for KLUD, frequencies, scroll down, find departure 118.10, and touch active. And that's it. It's actually much, much quicker than the old way of saying, well, I could always call the nearest center frequency and ask, but on a busy radio frequency, you might not be able to get in. And this is actually much quicker anyway. If you'd like to learn more about our private three-day in-flight training for aircraft owners, for our three-day training for part 13561 military and law enforcement fleet training, or to get the full GTN 650, 750, NXI series mastery online training. Just visit us anytime at pilotsafety.org. This is Gary, the guy in the pink shirt. Thanks for hanging out with me.